Hey everyone, Michael here. And I wanted to tell you about this link that I stumbled upon as I was browsing some of the PlayStation 4 news. And this was a link and it was a theme collection. So if you want to take a quick peek at what that theme would look like, you can just simply double click and it will tell you maybe if the background was changed along with maybe some of the different types of icons. Let's try a, another theme here. So again, another background change. So this one has a bit of a mixture of the background that's used on the home screen and an accent change for some of the colors inside of settings. Once you find the one that you would like, simply go to the ellipsis and then download, and then you can just click on download as zip. Okay, and so once you found the theme that you like, go ahead and extract it. Sometimes you're gonna to have to use WinRAR or 7-Zip or WinZip to extract these files, but go ahead and extract the one that you like, and you should see a JPEG and then two packages. Let's just go ahead and let's copy all of this to a USB stick or through FTP. In this instance, I'm using a USB drive, so I'm just going to paste those into the root of the drive. Again, this drive can be formatted in XFAT or FAT32. Now let's take that drive and let's head over to our PlayStation 4. Okay, back over on our PlayStation 4, let's go ahead and let's go in to our settings and we're gonna go to Gold Hen. And in my instance, I used a USB for this one. So I've inserted my USB drive and I'm gonna go to Package Installer and I'm just gonna simply select Install All. It shouldn't take very long. Okay, and so now just go ahead and head back over to your settings again. And we're gonna go down to themes and we're going to select a theme. And there you go, you should see the theme. Now it does have a little lock by it, which means that you will need to be on a gel broken system. So this is obviously for 9.00 but I understand that this does work on some of the lower firmwares. So go ahead and hit X, and then we are going to click on Apply. Okay. There is the new theme. And, huh, it looks very, very cool. So I can tell that some of the icons have already changed. We kind of got this video that's playing right there in the background. Uh, but anyway, it looks like it's a pretty cool uh, tweak. You can obviously go back into settings and, uh, and enjoy this purple color, or you can go back to where it says themes, select theme, and then pick whichever one that you like. And it'll be reset back to that. Okay, well, that's it. That's all that I've got for you today. Merry Christmas. I love you all. Thank you so very much for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. Michael, out.